Good morning, uh, here we are in my kitchen and um, just to let you know this is day four and the, probably the two biggest things that have happened to me overnight. Number one is um, I did a yoga this morning and I was way, way more flexible than I have been in a long time so that's really cool. Um, when I went to bed last night I was wired so energy is going through the roof which is, uh, which is good. And also, um, not so pleasant, but um, a uh, little cyst on my back has been, which has been there for so long, is suddenly going down in size, which is pretty incredible as well. So a really good start to day four, and uh, we're just about to have breakfast. So have a little look at this. So I moved my my new toy, which is one of these. This is Hazel. Say hello. hello. Right. She is making a pancake, so I'm just gonna. Yeah, but it's a pancake with a difference because it's actually made with eggs, but it's instead of flour, I've substituted with ground almonds, and I've pa actually put it through the Nutri Bullet because I find it makes a better, smoother pancake. Although the girls like them a bit more crunchy. Um, if you haven't got ground almonds, you could always use uh, gluten-free flour if you really wanted to. Um, and then what I've done is I'm experimenting. I'm using stevia drops that have lemon flavour in them. From, uh, which so, was suggested by Claire Fuller. Thank you very much, Claire. Um, and then it's just literally a bit of water, a bit of ground almonds, some eggs, and then, and then a few drops of stevia. And then I'm cooking it. This is the important bit. You've got to cook it. You've got to, that's, my, <laughs> that's me, not my. <laughs> <laughs> Have I got that? I've no idea. Yep. Um, what we've got here is actually, this is uh, coconut oil, but it's in a really good pan. This is Jamie Oliver, actually, this pan, and I love it. Ooh, that's a nice sound. I don't go for giant pancakes, I go for about that size. Put the lid on and then just let that cook off for about a minute or so until what you're looking for is that surface starts to produce little bubbles um, and then you can just flip it over and it won't fall apart. Have you said what the, so the ingredients? Have you told us what the ingredients are? Uh, well, I'm cooking for uh, four people, so it was 200 grams of ground almonds, four eggs, 200 millilitres of water, and then about 10 drops of stevia as my experiment. If not, I often use uh, I lemon you, juice and um, xylitol. So we've no idea <clears throat> whether the um, stevia is going to be any good, so Claire Fuller you're in trouble, this doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, there you go. Um, I'll uh, cut this now and um, give you another look when the, when the pancake's done. Okay, so um, pancake is done. Let me show you the first one. Look at that beauty there. Right, test. So I've got to test it now. So, uh, just put that there. You know, that is pretty good. That's pretty it gives good. a little bit of sweetness, doesn't it? Mm. So you, you haven't put much in there. You could put, always put a bit more in. But actually, pretty, pretty tasty and quite filling, surprisingly. So there you go, that's our breakfast for this morning. Um, if you like our, um, I should look at the camera, shouldn't I, rather than look at the screen. If you like our, um, sort of recipe style program um give us some likes okay bye see you tomorrow